evening. Welcome to 22 News at 11. I'm Matt Karen. A man killed in a head on collision in Belchertown Friday has been identified as Larry Kelly, an influential Amherst blogger. 22 News reporter Tashani Wintlow went back to Amherst tonight to find out how the community is coping with the sad news. That's right, Matt. A man familiar with Kelly's contributions to the town of Amherst told me despite Kelly's controversial views, he was like the watchdog of Amherst. Uh, it's a sad day. And I think a lot of people mourn him, both liberal, conservative. 62-year-old Larry Kelly has been identified as the victim of Friday's deadly accident in Belchertown. Kelly was killed in a head-on crash on Route 9 in Belchertown just before 3 o'clock Friday afternoon. Tell me that he's passed and uh, I think about his contribution to the town. Kelly was an influential Amherst blogger. His blog was called Only in the Republic of Amherst. He often took a public stance on controversial topics, like when the town did not fly the American flag for an anniversary of 9-11. A man who was familiar with Larry Kelly's contributions to the town of Amherst to 22 News, Larry Kelly kept people in Amherst honest and held them accountable for their actions. Kind of person that you really need to have in a town this size and keep everybody on their toes. Yeah, I think Larry was well known and probably respected for uh, his viewpoint and um, bringing up some of the topics he did to uh, keep Amherst uh, honest. Kelly was traveling on Route 9 when a vehicle being driven by an 18-year-old collided with his vehicle. A Springfield man gave his condolences to Kelly's family. I really do empathize with it because I think it's a sad thing, you know, a sad event, especially somebody who had a lot of things going on and a lot, of get, lot to give to the community. So it really is a regret. It's a sad loss. Route 9 was shut down for about three hours while police tried to figure out what happened. The state police crash reconstruction unit and the Belchertown police are investigating investigating this crash. It's a sad loss. The 18-year-old and his two passengers were taken to Bay State Medical Center. They're all expected to be okay. No charges have been filed. Live in the 22 News studio, Tashani Whitlow, 22 News.